Hi everyone and welcome to what's my unboxing video. Relaya Deluxe Edition. In general, I'm not the most <laughs> biggest fan of Mecha team, but because it's tactic style, strategy RPG from Kadokawa Games and previous mm, tactics game tactics style game from them was God Wars and I liked <laughs> that game so much that I'm quite excited for this game as well even though I'm not the biggest fan of mecha team in general well I guess they are called stellar gears in this game but anyway <laughs> so yeah let's open the box and by the way <laughs> sorry for the noise in the background there's some <laughs> construction work very close to the building so that might <laughs> be picked by the mic of the camera i suppose i could have waited until they are done <laughs> and then start recording the video but i'm so excited to start playing the game that i couldn't <laughs> wait longer so a little Leaf cover on the box. <laughs> Weird note, I think that must be one of the biggest zero mm, age rating logos I've seen. <laughs> Most of the time they are very standard sized, like half of that, but thankfully <laughs> it's on the paper cover, so no any logos on the cover of the box itself. Shiny box. <laughs> I like that. And very minimalistic backside. But how are the contents? Some sort of art book. Quick sneak peek there. I believe let's leave that for last. And original soundtrack. And game itself with some pre order bonuses inside. And that's already everything. So, not a huge amount of content, but that art book <laughs> looks quite thick, so it might take <laughs> a moment to go through all that. But before that, Let's take a quick look inside the soundtrack keys. So, really a original soundtrack into the lost code. So, 15 tracks in total. No, any booklet. I do like the character designs that I've seen so far. <laughs> Cute characters. And because the art book is so <laughs> huge, let's take a quick look inside the game box as well. So rest of the video is <laughs> just going through the 
art book and inside here is the disk of course and some pre-order bonus item set so it's mainly just some in-game in items like job points so you can unlock some skills early on <laughs> I might <laughs> not even redeem this because I don't like having like extra items or mm, things like that early on in the game from these pre-order bonuses or something like that even though they are small bonuses I feel like they kind of break the balance of the early game experience but yeah there's the expiration date 10 years <laughs> I don't think I have seen <laughs> so long expiration date on these codes before at least it's not common <laughs> usually it's like year or something but next let's start going through this huge art book is the artwork actually yeah it seems like it continues cool I'll just bend the spine a little bit because it's <laughs> Weird habit of mine. And now let's start going through here. So, contents. Seems like Nice amount of contents, 100 pages about. So, starts with quick introduction to the story of the game. And you can see some screenshots from battle system and also some cutscenes or I believe these are like attack animations actually and also there's some character customization <laughs> keywords <laughs> so if you are lost in the story and need remind yourself of some keywords. <laughs> One little addition. And next the characters. Yeah I do like these character designs. Also some info of the characters. Oh, even like stats and so on. That's quite cool. Addison. And I believe her Stella gear. Also some rankings of the Stella gear stats. First was like melee style, 
character and she's like longer range character I believe there was like four different types of Stella gears for the characters so is this like some sort of scout I believe they were like Mm, kind of like support characters, healing and buffing and debuffing and so on. And is the last one like tank character with higher defensive stats, maybe. From the trailers, the combat system seems a little bit simple, but <laughs> seeing the amount of huge amount of characters makes me so excited. <laughs> Can't wait to find out more about these characters and how much you can customize their playstyle and so on. So I'm guessing mm, these are the non-playable characters. It seems no stellar gears for each of them. One thing I am wondering about the gameplay, because the battles that I have seen in the trailer so far take place in like these empty spaces with nothing in them but the characters themselves. I wonder how quickly that gets mm, get like repetitive feeling when there's not much on the environment to interact with. But maybe that changes <laughs> throughout the game. And it's only the early battles with 
so much in empty space in them. So more characters with Stalakia, so I'm guessing from the dark name here, maybe these are like enemy characters. both the game box itself and also the deluxe edition box. Did it even realize that game box has the same artwork? And there's the cover art of this art book. <laughs> art of the environment looking mansion. I don't know much about the story in the game. I'm excited to find out about the story. What is going in there? I've mainly seen some gameplay trailers and so on. different kind of environments and planet surfaces and mechanic so these stellar gear designs different color variations and so on There's assault type and tank type and snipe type and scout type. <laughs> so yeah, 
four different types for the makers. So yeah, now again to assault and tank type. So like second <laughs> kind of upgraded version <laughs> of the same types of the tank of the stragglers. And next two weapons, starting with the assault <laughs> type weapons, I believe, since these are the melee weapons. And machine guns. So longer type weapons and rifles. Oh, and shields. <laughs> I suppose it makes sense for the tank type to have shield. <laughs> Maybe the scout type gear and next to event GG. So the story scenes are at work. Start playing, the, playing the game. The, see the store. And setting design. So some commentary on the designs. Nice that <laughs> a little bit of that. Oh, <laughs> and also some creator interview at the end here. <laughs> I 
be the director of the game. Excited to translate these. Also some commenting on the card wars. <laughs> If you like tactic style games, definitely give a try to Card Wars <laughs> and also in this game, of course. And that's everything. I really like the <laughs> art book, so huge and a lot of content in there. So, yeah. Mm, somewhat simple deluxe edition because only a game, soundtrack and art book, but because the art book is so huge, I really like it. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, <laughs> and seeing all that artwork and characters and also those event GGs made me <laughs> so excited to start the game. But yeah, I guess that's everything. Mm, this unboxing was <laughs> quite late because mm, the game was released like a month ago. I usually get these games like little over a week after release. But I've been having some shipping issues. But hopefully mm, after this <laughs> I'm getting more back to normal mm, schedule. But yeah, thanks for watching and bye!